I think that there's only so much that can be done top down and that there's a whole kind of um, chunk of work that DEI practitioners um, need to help support and cultivate um, to ensure that there's that grassroots movement, that there's this sort of snowball effect. You know, we're in this increasingly polarized world and what is going to help um, you know, bring people together and build bridges is trust. And I think that this is what we're doing in the DEI space, is that we are building trust with our people. Absolutely. Um, we are saying that, you know, bring your authentic self to work. And when we're asking people and encouraging people to do that, we're asking them to trust us. Um, so I think that that is just, yeah, the theme that came out for me. I think the other um, piece of the other challenging thing that you meet throughout at any moment is just resistance. And I think that's motivated by fear and, and, a, and a worry that, that in order for others to thrive, I might have to pull back. Because we have this, um, we've, so, we've been socialized from the time that we're children that in order for us to win, someone else has to lose, mm -hmm. which is an inherently flawed concept. Um, that as much as it may feel, feel polarized, we're having conversations that we hadn't had before, and nothing bad can come of conversations when we truly listen to one, one another.